So I've been pretty quiet on this uh, SDR. Uh, as you know, I encountered some uh, some nasty problems with uh, uh, some kind of harmonics or resonance in the circuit. And uh, I have been uh, sort of thinking uh, how to attack the problem. As you can see, I've uh, I've been trying a few things here. One of the things that I tried is to move the SI5351 completely off the board um, and uh, sort of control it externally and then just pump the uh, uh, the LO signals into the board. That actually did nothing at all. Uh, quite surprisingly, um, uh, it didn't ch it didn't change remotely the uh, the those strange harmonics that I was seeing. Um, so the other thing, apart from littering the board with uh, decoupling caps, let me just get this off so I can turn the board over. The other thing that I tried is uh, is mounting the board. Uh, the uh, this is the uh, ESP thirty two A one S header board. Mounting that on the reverse side of the board, the theory being I'll uh, I'd have at least a ground plane between the, what's going on here and the uh, the audio circuitry. That didn't do anything either. I mean, it worked, but uh, it uh, it had exactly the same those same around eight kilohertz um, uh, audio signals coming out. So I'm you know I'm frankly stumped at this stage with uh, with this board. What I'm going to do is I, I think I might uh, abandon this uh, this board here um, and go back to uh, some of the original designs I had using the PCB artist. Let me uh, show you that board. So this is one of the designs I'd done earlier um, and it consists of an ESP32, just a standard ESP32. Um, and this is the PCB artist's um, uh, ES8388 board that I've used before. Um, uh, and I quite like, um, they're a little bit expensive, but uh, they, are some, they are quite reliable. So what I might do is, is redesign this board to uh, take advantage of, of these two components here. Now obviously it's going to be kind of, it's going to look completely different. So I do have to go back to basics, but uh, I've been banging my head against this board for so long that uh, uh, I think a fresh look is, is what's required. I, I am a bit disappointed that I, that I wasn't able to really, <clears throat> excuse me, trace where the problem is. Um, cause, uh, <laughs> there's always the chance that I'll do this, uh, these two components on the new board and I'll get exactly the same problem or, or a similar problem. So, uh, but anyway, you have to keep trying with this stuff. So, um, I thought I'd, I, I, I owe you all a quick update on where this board is. Um, so stay tuned for the new looking board here. Um, and, uh, we'll see what, uh, we'll see what we'll see. Uh, okay. That's all for now.